move, synth. What have you done with the real Riley? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a synth. Don't shoot, for God's sake, we're family! Put the gun down, now! He's a synth! He'll kill us all! Kyle! Oh, no! Okay, show's over. There are no synths in Diamond City. Hear me? You folks are damn paranoia. Dog meat. Get the scent, boy. Take me to him, boy. Take me to Sean. <laughs> You dog meat would sniff our man out. Let's you and I take it from here. Give our four legged friend a break. Hostile sensor reading detected. Something you need? Think you can unlock that terminal? Yeah. <laughs> okay. You made it. I'm 
just up ahead. My synths are standing down. Let's talk. And there she is. The most resilient woman in the Commonwealth. You came You murdering kidnapping. Right to it then, huh? Mm -hmm. Your son, Sean. Uh -huh. But if you're hoping for a... Tell me where he is, damn it. Fine. Sean's in a good... Right? The Institute? God, you're persistent. But I think... You must. Look around, get all the intel this place can hunt. Nick. So, Kellogg wasn't giving us any bull. Your son really is on the inside. Even I don't know where the Institute is. And they built me. There has to be a way. <sighs> We're in the weed. Only person I know willing to snoop up. Diamond City it is. Hey, chin up. See that big blimp? Well, well. Nikki Valentine walks into my office for a change. What can I say, Piper? You, me, and hard luck all seem to run together like acid rain down an old sewer. You, uh, including your client here in that analogy? So, you two are finally letting me in on this little case of yours. What's the story? We need help, Piper. The Institute. I've been investigating these creeps for over a year now. Right. True enough. Sometimes they... Where the in... Exactly. <sighs> Kellogg. Man like that would have had... But we both know... Because... So... Uh-huh. He wasn't gonna talk. Gets his brain. You're talking crazy. Look, there's a place. If anyone could get a dead brain to sing, it'll be Dr. Amari. The mind behind the memories. I hope you're right, Nick. Let's see. 
I guess we're gonna need a piece of Kellogg's. Jesus, Nick. I know it's gr Actually, I think I already have something. Kellogg had this, this thing attached to his head. Cybernetics, huh? Whether we're riding- I have to go to the- mm -hmm. It's you and me, Nick. Let's get going. Don't worry. We're gonna get your boy back. Just a few more steps. While you two are out, I'm gonna do some more research. I'll be here if you need me. And by the way... Even good people do crazy things when they're scared. Checking down another wayward husband to his mistress? Why? Someone stand you up? You trying that, uh, what do you call it? Evasive language on me? And who are you, huh? Valentine's new dick in training? We're working together, yeah. Really? Will you? Unless it's... Now don't be like that. Uh -huh. You hand over everything you got in their pockets, or accidents start happening to you. Big, bloody accidents. Nick Valentine makes a rare visit to town, and you're hassling his friend here with that extortion crap? Good to see you again, Nick. Hancock? What do you care? She ain't one of us. No love for your mayor, Finn. I said let her go. You soft, Hancock. You keep letting outsiders walk all over us. One day, there'll be a new man. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. Let me tell you something. Why'd you have to go and say that, huh? Breaking my heart over here. You all right, sister? I'm fine. Thanks for good. Now, good neighbors. Yeah, I feel you. Good. You stay sure. So long as you. Mr. Valentine, I thought you had forgotten about the May have walked out of the den, Irma, but I'd never walk out on you. Hmm. I'm not downstairs, you bitch. Dr. Amari? Yes? Wait, I remember you. The memory inducement. Vault 111, right? What's this all about? We need your help, Doctor. I... I know what you're asking. Are you two men putting aside the fact... Please. This dead... Fine. Mm hmm. Here's... what I could find. What's this? This isn't a brain. This is... Wait. That's the hippocamp? Uh, there's... I'm not surprised. Go on, Doctor. Mr. Valentine, but that's... Don't worry about... Hey. You can thank me when... Uh -huh. I'm ready, Mr. Valentine. Just sit down. If I start cackling like an old grizzled mercenary, pull me out, okay? Let's see here. I need you to keep talking to me, Mr. Valentine. Any slight change in your cognitive functions could be dire. Are you feeling any different? A lot of flashes. Static. I, I, I can't make sense of any of it, Doc. That's what I was afraid of. The mnemonic impressions are encoded. It appears the Institute has one last failsafe. There's a lock on the memories in the implant. Tell me you have... Let me think. Uh -huh. We load both you... Sure. He'll act as a hope. All right. Let's get started. Just sit down over there. See you on the other side. Initiating brainwave migration between the transplant and the host. Mnemonic activity coming from the transplant. It's degenerated, but it's there. 
We are going to load you into the strongest memories we can find. They might not be stable. Just hold on. Can you hear me? Ah, good. The simulation appears to be working, although the memories are quite fragmentary. I'll try to step you through the intact memories and hope we find one that gives us some clue to the Institute's location. There. This is the earliest intact memory I can find. This doesn't seem to be what we're looking for. There appears to be another intact memory close to you in temporal sequence. There. Let's keep looking. I'll connect you to the next intact memory. How did you think this was going to end, Kellogg? <laughs> you thought you could just fuck with us, and we wouldn't fuck with you? Just so you know, they died like dogs. I found and another you memory to try. Weren't there you. to help them. Well, we seem to be getting closer. Try this next one. I'm glad you're getting warmer. One of these has got to tell us something. We're running out of brain here. Ah, ah there's one that looks mostly intact. Manual Connecting now. Cryogenic stasis. I found another intact memory. Whenever you're ready. Is that your son? This appears to be a very recent memory. So, good news, I think. Kellogg. It's okay. One of these days, you're gonna get your head blown off just barging in here like that. Minimizing my exposure to civilians is a priority. Forget I said anything. So what's the big crisis this time? New orders for you. One of our scientists has left the Institute. Left? As in? He's gone rogue. Name's Dr. Brian Virgil. We know he's hiding somewhere in the glowing sea. Here's his file. Wow. Some heads are gonna roll for this. Capture and return, or just elimination? Elimination. He was working on a highly classified program. No kidding. One of the top bioscience boys? Damn. So, I guess you're taking the kid back with you. Affirmative. Your only mission is to locate and eliminate Virgil. You're taking me home to my father? Yes. Stand next to me and hold still. Okay. It's all over, but the dreaming. X688. Ready to relay with Sean. Bye, Mr. Kellogg. I hope I see you again soon. Teleportation. Now it all makes sense. Nobody's found the entrance to the Institute because there is no entrance. Let me pull you out of there as soon as you're ready.
kind of side effects the procedure might have had. No one's ever done this before. How do you feel? I'm okay, Doctor. Thank you. That's good. But I want you to keep monitoring yourself. We have to be sure there's no long-term damage. Are you ready to talk about what happened in there? We got what we needed. The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. Yes. Their greatest secret is... That scientist... You're right. Where did the... If we need to find Virgil... If you're going to go... I'll find a way to get through the wreck. Good luck. And... Mm -hmm. By the way... <laughs> Don't let all that horsepower go to you. Hope you got what you were looking for inside my... Nick. What? What are you talking about? You sounded like... Did I? Uh-huh. Anyway, I... I'm gonna head out on my own from here, Nick. Good luck out there. You know where to find me. Hey, everyone. Gather around. Let's keep it brief. Hey, Valentine. Time to hit... Now I know you all are Time doing to hit the road. Thing. But I don't want anyone Just here to forget what matters. Just look at a trade a little. Oh, sure thing. Hey. Easy. Glad you could make it. How's my... there's anything I can do to lighten the load, or, you know, if you need anything proofread. Hey, Piper. Heading my way? Sure, let's go. Will do. Hey. Wow. 